in this video you will be learning about calculating the sum of the odd numbers in Fortran so let's start the video for this I have created this folder Fortran named Fortran in previous video where I have calculated I have shown you to calculate the sum of the even numbers in the Fortran okay and this is the folder you can watch that video by clicking on that i button or the link is given in the description now let's start this video so for this uh, on this folder i need to open the terminal okay and uh, here i create the create a file named as and let it be odd okay f90 this is for odd number so i name this as odd and the extension of the fortran file is dot f90 let me click press enter and the folder will open like this and let me clear you that make you clear that to calculate the sum of the even numbers i have written this code okay so the method is same only the formula will be different okay which formula this formula will be different okay so in this video also this program okay and this program helps you to calculate sum of odd numbers from 1 to so it will be also 350 okay <coughs> so this is what we have to do for this now let's name the program first let name be as it is odd sum okay and uh, of course implicit noun is there and uh, let me uh, let uh, define variables in integer form as well okay so all variables are integer so that will be someone and i n okay save it and give the first value of someone as zero and so we have to calculate the sum of the odd numbers from 2 to 350 okay and that even num uh, odd numbers start from one one is odd number two is even number okay three is odd number so we can we include one three five and so on okay so for this we need to define the formula and for this we use do loop i text value 0 2 1 okay not 0 2 1 0 2 and the maximum number is 350 okay so let it be uh, 0 2 and half of the one 350 is 175 okay with okay we don't need any steps do i text value 0 to 175 and the n value will be 2 times i plus 1 okay so that what will it happens when i is 0 okay because i takes value from 0 to 175 so i is 0 this term will be 0 so that i is equal to 1 okay this is our number when i is 1 okay i is 1 then this term will be 2 2 into 1 is 2 and plus 1 gives you 3 which is also odd number when i is 3 okay i is 2 when i is 2 then 2 into 2 is 4 plus 1 gives you 5 and so on okay and all these all these n are odd numbers so now we have to define the sum sum is equal to someone someone is equal to someone plus n okay and of course 
print we will print en okay and end do and after ending the do loop we print sum is summon okay so this gives the odd numbers and this gives sum of the odd numbers also and program should be ended okay now save it so we have to run this program to see the result now go to terminal then i have created this file on the same directory as where i open the terminal okay this is our photon code for calculating the calculating the sum of the odd numbers now let me uh, run the program g photon for that g photon um, odd okay it is like this after typing this much press enter the code is correct okay to see the result we just type this command and then press enter okay so <clears throat> So odd numbers it starts from 1, 3, 5, 7 and it goes up to 351 but 351 is greater than what greater than 350 so we, we should exclude this we should include up to 345 so what we need to do here is so that let me reduce this term then it will be 174 instead of 175 because double of 175 is gives you let me show you now run the code now it is up to 375 351 okay now it is 349 okay 349 is less than 350 so the sum is this okay so this is the sum let me check it by another method now i need to define another sum one okay sum two and j okay we will define we don't need to define n okay now let it be uh, sum 2 will be 0 again okay and this is print this is first method okay here we use second method in second method why what we do is we text j okay do loop j is equal to so it must be from 1 to mm, 350 okay 350 with the interval or step 2 and then sum 2 is equal to sum 2 plus j print it will also print j which will be odd numbers and do then again print the sum that is sum 2 okay now check the result again so basically sum 1 will be equal to sum 2 okay because the j have same values as n here that those are odd numbers okay let me check it and run the code again on terminal okay see let me go to the first okay i start from here so this is from first method okay the number starts from one three five and all numbers are odd numbers you can check it okay and the sum is this from first method again from second method the odd numbers start from one okay three five and so on up to what 349 the odd numbers are same as those given by the first method also the sum is same 30625 
we can also check it 30625 so in this way you can calculate the sum of even numbers in the given range okay yep. uh, sum of the odd numbers in the given range so i used here the range from 1 to 350 okay so the both method method gives you the same result you can use any method any of this method okay thank you for watching this video please don't forget to like this video and subscribe the channel okay if you have any suggestions or comments then you can leave it on the comment box in the comment section okay thank you